Oh my god, what have I done? <laughs> Alright guys, now drop, sh drop tests are something that have been done so many times, so many variations, just normal, just throw off a ladder drop test. Um, you know, MNR's done those with the Coliseum. There's float, throw your Lego sets in the pool drop test. That's Republic Studs there. Now I thought I'd put my own twist on this. This is something I've done before, but I thought I'd do a whole video on it. Today we're going to be testing dropping Lego sets out of a dropship. So essentially, how this works is essentially- Okay, so there's a clipping mechanism on the dropship, and what happens if we just let go of it? And we're going to be testing this on, um, various sets. Uh, ATTs, turbo tanks, and more. But before the video starts, Boomer here who's strapped on the dropship, which I, I hope he's- you know, no, no, dropship's not getting dropped, he'll be fine. But yeah, um, watch till the end of the video, and I may drop a gunship. I, I don't want to, but I might have to, just- just baby. You know what, part two, uh, if this gets like 30 likes, I'll do a part two and I'll drop my gunship. Actually, no, 40 likes because I don't want to drop my gunship. So like it up if you want to see me uh, drop test my gunship. So yeah, anyway, so uh, I, I forget what I was going to say. But yeah, like and subscribe and hit that bell to support me even more. Watch till the end to see me drop this, uh, all these cool vehicles. And don't worry, um, well, I, I was going to say no vehicles were harmed in this video, but uh, that, that's probably a lie. So let's get straight into it. Sorry for the shaky camera, I have like Tourette's or something. Alright guys, so you guys have a view of my bookshelf here. Uh, but essentially that's not what it's, what, what's important. You guys have a nice angle of how I'm going to be dropping the set. So first of all, let's just take a look at the set we are dropping. So yeah, if we could, I mean, it's going to be hard to like get a good camera angle. But this is a custom 212th juggernaut. The door's open. We don't want anybody fall. You know what, let's do something else. So we're going to put a couple clones inside and see if they could stay in their seats. But yeah, make sure you go check out my review on this. It's from One Stud. I'm not sure if he sells this model anymore, but it's super cool and I definitely recommend it. So yeah, um, I'm going to put a couple clones inside and let's see if they surv survive, um, I don't know if blunt force trauma or just getting dropped. So yeah. So I got, I got a good variety of clones here. We got a CAC jet guy, I don't know. We got a Lego dude, um, we got Cody, who does not have a visor. Doesn't matter, it would fall off anyway. We have a commando dude that I made. Make sure you go check the tutorial for this guy. Pretty simple to make. And we got another one of these. So, yeah. Um, let's put them into the thing. Wait, quick break from the bookshelf angle. And why does the lighting look so terrible in the... Oh, okay. So we have Cody on one side. We have a 212th on the other. Uh, bearing him. We have a guy in the front. A guy on top. And a guy in the back, so yeah, let's see how this goes. And my camera looks terrible right now, I don't know why it looks... Okay, that did not help. Okay, let's see the drop test. We we have Boomer on top of the drop ship. Nothing's gonna happen to him. Wait, I didn't think of this. I don't think I could have a figure on the top. We're just gonna throw him in loosely. Just throw him... In. I don't know. You know what, I'll, I'll just leave out the jet trooper, I'm sorry. Um, But yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and clip it on so you kind of see how it works there. You can see the mechanism. Uh, this thing's surprisingly heavy, so yeah, we're gonna try and kind of roll it. Hopefully that works. Um, okay, so, oh, some boomer just fell. Okay, that's not ideal. But we are having some te technical difficulties first. Um, alright, so, I don't exactly remember how to do this. Let's see if I do. I don't think that was a great angle. But, um, uh, you know what? I'm gonna hope that was good enough. Uh, okay. Yeah, that this is not a- Oh, the guy fell out! That's- Oh wait, no, I put him out, never mind. Oh yeah, we have some damage here. Okay, I forgot to state my hypothesis. Why is my- My drawer's open and it's just shadowing the- Okay, so- Okay, my hypothesis was that the, the wheels were gonna take the damage. And then the rest of it was gonna be fine. And I did not really- it, Okay, I'm gonna be honest here. Um, the- the- The roll thing did not work out. I just threw it down. Uh, and I don't even think I had a good angle. I might have to re-record. Okay, I've taken a look at the angle. It was bad. I'm gonna redo it. Let's rebuild it. Let's see if we could have a more successful... I mean, I don't know what the... Uh, we, let's see if we could... Let's do it again. We've gone ahead and rebuilt it. Um, in, okay, this guy stayed seated, so that, that's nice. Um, that guy's... Okay, so everybody stayed seated. That, that's good. That's good. Good for them. Good for them. All right. Let's do it again and let's get a good angle this time. I won't let you guys down, hopefully. Guys, Boomer has been joined by the Jet Trooper guy. And yeah, let's get a good drop test this time. Um, I don't know. I'm scared to do this. Gotta move back a little. Oh, okay. 
Okay, that, that was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good take. All right, guys, by the way, I'm not going to be dropping this from, like, um, like, high. That would, I, I like this set. Okay, you can see some of the damage here. Um, you know what? It, it's not bad. He was stopped per perfectly by Percy Jackson and Darth Vader. Nice, nice. Showing his love for the clones, I guess. Okay, taking a look at it, it it's... Let's just take a look. So, first of all, what happened here is the door opened. Uh, okay, that, 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 I don't know if that was important. That, I don't know if the, I hope, okay. You know what? This thing looks like it can function really well with three wheels. Um, yeah, that, that opened. I think everybody stayed seated. That was, that's nice. Uh, yeah, everybody's good. Uh, the only problem is, uh, let's close everything up. The, the, the side doors seem to open a lot. We lost the f two front wheels on the right. I mean, the we got lost two back wheels, and we lost the right front wheel. So, yeah, that, that was pretty good. And I think, wait, we did lose a plate. Like, last time we lost a lot of plates as well, but this one, like, the pieces are in, like, sm they're, like, in smaller pieces there. So that that's odd. And, yeah, let's, let's rebuild this and move on to the ATT. All right, so we rebuilt it, and I'm actually gonna be building a UCS version of this with like 1,800 pieces, and I don't want to drop test sets. However, if this video does get 70 likes, I will drop test that. Please, please, please. If you're watching this in the far future, or not the far, if you're watching this in just the future, and you see this has 69 likes, don't like it. And not, not because of the immature reason, because I don't want to drop test the UCS Turbo Tech. It's such a beautiful model. I don't even know if it's like the wheels will sustain I'm not sure, but point is, this one, very sturdy. I think part of the, like, the, the wheels are a very nice mechanism. Now, with the ACT, I have to make a hypothesis. Now, I think that it's going to work similarly. However, the it's going to be way, it's going to be much harder to put together the, um, the, uh, legs back together. Because it's, there are a lot more parts in that. And they're not wheels, they're not going to absorb the fall as well. And some of the structural intact, I don't know if it's going to, the, the actual build of the ATT besides the legs, it's going to uh, be as unscathed as this. But, uh, I'm going to hope. And if it doesn't, then please like. Uh, this, this is, this is kind of frightening for me. I, I, that was like a $150 ATT. The 2013 one does not come cheap nowadays. I'm gonna try and get a bigger view for this one, but um, we're gonna go ahead and move that uh, turbo tank. It's a nice turbo tank. I don't want it getting squashed by the ATT. But let's load up the ATT with some figures. It's also a 212 ATT. I'll show it on the camera now. All right here, we have the modded ATT. I want. I just modded it one time. I had nothing to do for a video, so I just did that. Make sure you go check that out that video. And inside, I'm gonna be having well, first of all, the guy on top. We're gonna have Waxer and Boyle from CAC, who for some reason don't have helmets, and an airborne guy. I think I'm gonna put one in the cockpit, which is probably gonna be the airborne, and waxer and boil in the back. There's no actual, um, room in the front, like, here, so that's unfortunate, but yeah. I just opened this up, and I discovered there's already two two twelfths in here, so we're gonna just add, uh, I don't know, we're just gonna add, you know what, they can just stay, you know, no, they're, they're getting evicted. Waxer and boil are cooler, um, but yeah, let's just put them in, uh, there we go. No, no, oh, oh, he fell. Uh, well, I'll just cut the cameras. Oh, yeah, those those were chilling in there. As for the rest, um, we're forced to have it closed for the drop test. We put the airborne up top and because we were having a problem, like, um, uh, putting him in just because of his cloth. And we have the 212th guy in there, so they, they're both frightened for their life, and they should be. But, yeah, let's get, let's cut to the drop test. You know what? I just should test. I put these two guys here. I want to see if this guy lives. Let's see if he stays. So yeah, an actual drop test now. Quickly, while I'm hooking it together, I would just like to tell you that this drop ship is actually from Republic Bricks. And the LIGO one costs a fortune. I was like, what, four in 2010? So uh, yeah, that one. LIGO one was not an option. And I've had this one for a while. Make sure to go check out my review on that, uh, on this one actually. It's one of my most viewed videos, so you won't have any problem finding it. And yeah, uh, oh my god, I, I'm, I'm frightened. Uh, Move that out of the way. I, I by the way, I kicked that because I don't want anybody to see my face. Uh, oh god. Oh god. One, two. Oh, oh, oh that did not work. Yikes! I can I can rebuild it, but oh my god, what have I done, dude? This thing is wrecked. No, this clone didn't even stay on the side, dude. There's. 
the, the things that's my those are my shorts though, but I don't know why those are there. Dude, there there's like pieces everywhere. Oh, it's in the Republic Fix business card. Post a picture of your set or order or not, I'm reading through the you know, you could read it if you want to. But this thing is absolutely wasted. That is see I see this is the problem with the legs. It, like they weren't gonna land all like perfectly. Oh, that is no, that is just a yikes moment. Okay, well let's get rebuilding. First little bit done. Oh, okay, that that like fell off, but it was like that always falls off. So it's in one piece though. That's nice. So it's really just the legs, actually. I, like it, besides this, like, the only thing missing, the only reason it looks so destroyed, is because these are like not properly, like yeah, you guys know what I mean. And then like, like these fell off, but besides that, all I have to do is put together the legs, put these tube things back on, readjust the plates on the sides, and it's good to go. So thankfully, oh. This thing fell out. Uh, but waxer and boil are fine. Uh, po the driver's fine. Uh, and yeah, the other two clones are unfortunate casualties of the war. That's what we're gonna say. Alright, let's do a cool transition to like when it's finished being built. Alright. Alright, you know, I know, I know the, the front is kind of bad, but like th there was some internal damage. I might have to fix that later. Um, uh, but yeah, um, also I, I was like lifting it up to check like that, that problem out and I found a flaw in the handle. I was like holding it up and then this thing just, th this handle just, it just slipped off. So I had to like catch it with both hands and it kind of broke a little again, but I, I managed to rebuild it. So yeah, this is probably going to be, this is probably like one of my best videos. So I'm probably going to be pinning this. Like uh, I have my, I built a clone army in 24 hours pinned, which is a really good video. And it represents my channel really well, so uh, I remember that you have, like, you choose, like, two, so uh, I think I'm gonna be replacing one of those. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe, and, um, comment F to pay respects to the dead clones who died for this, the views.